Don't know. Coin. If you want some, I'll give it you. And team of the season is here now. You might want to go to Fifth Coins like that coin and use that code HABIT to get yourself 8% off. There's a link in the description. Go get your coins. All the lads and welcome to an informed Mark O'Brien review. This guy is a right wing back from England and Leicester City in the Barclays Premier League and is currently extinct on the market. He got his inform because he helped out during the battering of QPR at the weekend. If you didn't see that match, I recommend you go watch it on YouTube. So this is the team that I put him in. It's got Abel Hernandez, Montero, uh, Lalana, Gamboa and I played him at right wing on six chemistry in seven games minus two games because I bought him when he already had two games on him uh, so in five games he scored me three goals and got four assists I put the catalyst card he's got 79 pace 78 dribbling 70 shots 72 passing high medium work rates and three star skills and three star weak foot now you're wondering why did I play him in right wing because his normal card is a right mid and it's so hard to review right backs that I didn't want to have to go through it 83 curve and 81 in game dribbling 70 finishing 63 free kick accuracy and 72 shot power as you can see his only positions is right mid he's 24 years old he's five foot nine and he's got the early crosser trait now this guy is going for seven to seventeen thousand coins and is currently extinct and in right wing it was very very hard to review him even as a right wing because playing him on seven uh, sorry six chemistry meant that I couldn't get the goals that I needed because he wasn't actually going to be shooting as well as he could on 10 chemistry I hit the bar and the keeper saved it numerous different times when in reality if he was on full chemistry I probably would have scored those opportunities which is really really annoying but it's the harsh reality but like I said guys he's actually really good on the game now his long shots are incredible like I said I didn't actually score any just because he's not on full chemistry but I hit the bar and hit the post and the goalkeeper saved it so many different times it's actually ridiculous and it was starting to get so annoying to the point where I just didn't leave all of them in now his finishing feels really good inside the box I think he scored me he scored me three goals and all three of them were pretty nice goals indeed he got me four assists and he's really actually decent at passing um to be fair, for a right back that hasn't got any really good standout stats, he was actually a really good all-round player. Now, you're obviously looking at his 35 defending. He didn't put any defensive shift in at all for me. Not one. He didn't do anything defensively. Therefore, I do not recommend you put him at right back. Because, honestly, he just doesn't have the right defending. He's got high medium work rates and he's got 35 defending. It's just not going to help you out. Plus, he's a small player, which means he's not going to outmuscle any players. And it's going to be really, really annoying. But playing in that right wing on it will be seven chemistry once you play 10 games with him or you pack him uh, I think it's actually worth it now the annoying thing about Mark Albrighton is his dribbling is pretty bad but his pace actually feels a lot better than 79 so it kind of makes up for it um, and his dribbling wasn't like the worst of all of them but it was okay so on all the negatives and all the positives I've decided to give Mark Albrighton's inform the extinct player himself from Leicester an 8.7 out of 10 if you enjoyed this video leave a like down below I'm going to be doing a purple Jonas Gutierrez review next. And it will have been a hey, you guys are fantastic. And I'll see you lads later.